Well, the wet winter we experienced this past year is proving to be a very big help to our water supply. Yeah, because of the amount of rain and snow we got in the west, the Bureau of Reclamation is now rolling back some of the water cuts put into place during the drought. It's the, the only reason I'm here. We're looking at Lake Mead, what's left of it. Ross Angel wakes up to this view of Lake Mead from his Boulder City home. What have you noticed over the past couple of years? Well, it's been going down, 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 and down. After a moisture-packed winter, he's witnessed the changes firsthand. What have you noticed? Have you noticed the water going up at all? They keep telling me it has, and, and I guess a minute amount it has. I understand they pulled the uh, marina back in a little bit. Lake Mead is up nearly 20 feet since January, now sitting at 1,063 feet. It is expected to go up another four feet by January, thanks to snow in the Rockies. The August 24 month study is of particular interest. Following a new water projection report released Tuesday, the Bureau of Reclamation is now making adjustments. A tier one shortage will be in place for next year. Right now, this year, we're in a tier two reduction of 25,000 acre feet. Next year, we're gonna be in a tier one reduction of 21,000 acre feet. So it is a slight improvement. Bronson Mack is the public information officer from the Southern Nevada Water Authority. He says this means Nevada will be allocated more water from the Colorado River. But Nevada won't see much change as the state already uses less water than is allocated due to water conservation efforts. So over the last two decades, we've seen our community grow, yet we've seen our water demands reduced. We supply less water to more people today than we did two decades ago. But this doesn't mean water saving efforts can stop as more dry winters could happen. This good news comes as river water using states and the federal government begin talks about future guidelines for water use set to go into place after 2026. It was a good winter. Yeah, it was a lot of rain. Angel hopes more good winters will come not only to help his view, but everyone who uses the river and lake. Hopefully it'll all come back. Well, the water cut changes apply to Nevada, Arizona, California and Mexico.